What's going on YouTube? Hope you guys are having a great start to this Saturday morning. I'm back in the game with another video and welcome back to my channel NC Tub TV. So guys, I wanted to come on here real quick and give you an update on the Porsche and Dennis McKinley situation. Now, numerous outlets have reported that Porsche and Dennis couldn't agree on parenting. They couldn't agree on financial issues. Dennis thought that Porsche was very loose with her money and they was just having issues, right? But MTO News is reporting that all of those issues may be valid, but there was one issue in particular that caused Dennis to call off the wedding. And that was Portia refused to sign the prenup that Dennis wanted her to sign because he's worth about $30 million and he wanted to protect his assets. So let's run to the receipts that MTO News has provided for us and read what they had to say in regards to this matter. The new season of the Atlanta Housewives will feature the split of housewife Portia Williams, Split and her fiance Dennis McKinley. The split will play out in front of Bravo's cameras. Last month, all types of salacious rumors popped up online about alleged infidelity, but it wasn't infidelity that broke them up, it was money. MTO News confirmed that Dennis called the wedding off after Portia refused to sign a prenuptial agreement. According to a top source, Dennis is worth tens of millions of dollars and he wanted to protect his assets in the event of a divorce. The insider explained Dennis wanted a prenup and he was willing to be generous to Portia in it. She refused and that caused conflict. The insider continued, Portia is using a breakup to put pressure on Dennis to drop the prenup. She basically told him that she would still marry him if he gives up on the prenup. So far, Dennis is holding strong and not giving in to Portia's demands. We'll see how long he can keep it up though. Dennis motives were questioned right from the very beginning by viewers, as well as some of the ladies on the show, especially Candy. Candy tried to warn Portia that Dennis had dated around quite a bit and had several ladies names tattooed on his body, but Portia was uninterested. Those close to Portia know how badly she wanted a baby and questioned how quickly she rushed into this, but she did fall in love. They just wanted to see her take her time, the source added. Now guys, I must admit, it did seem a little bit thirsty on Portia's behalf to have a baby so fast with somebody that she didn't really know. Now they claimed that the two fell in love, but I just think Portia saw dollar signs, right? Now I want to say this, I do look at Portia as a type of individual that wouldn't want to sign a prenup because she's about them coins. Now, Dennis McKinley is being smart about his assets, and I think that that is rubbing Portia the wrong way due to the simple fact that she thought that she could con Dennis out of his money and it's not working. See, Portia realized that Dennis McKinley was smarter than she thought, and it just goes to show that her heart was not in the right place. Now, Dennis McKinley is going to learn that it was probably cheaper to keep her because with the child support that he may have to fork out, and he may have to pay Portia bills due to the simple fact of you know them having a child together. Even though that the report said that Dennis was going to be very generous to Portia within the prenup, I don't think he was gonna be as generous uh, as the courts would want him to be or gonna require him to be once Portia takes him to court for child support. And you know that's gonna happen. But anyway, guys, I wanna hear your true thoughts and assessments. Do you think that a prenuptial agreement is something that should happen between two people? Do you think that that shows that you really don't trust one another? And what would be the reason to even get married if you don't trust one another to do the right thing if you got a divorce? Give me your thoughts, all right? Also, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share this video, and if you're new here, don't be afraid to subscribe to my channel and smash that notification bell to be notified of when I will drop my next video. It's been real. Peace.